Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 38 in chapter 8. This chapter is about conservation of energy. We can see we have a very typical model of all these problems. A box is connected with a spring. At the initial position, this spring is compressed at 0.18 meter. And then the initial velocity is V1 equal to 0. Then we release this box. So the box will move to the position 2. At position 2, we know the velocity is 0, but we don't know the distance it is from the origin. So this is what we need. Is this surface a perfect surface? No. So we can see the part. They tell us the coefficient for the friction is 0 0.3. What does that mean? That means we must consider the friction force during this process. And we can see the, fr the fr friction just uh, backward, right? Pointing backward and distance upward, uh, the forward. So that means the friction do the work in this process. Do you agree? Yes. And when the friction do the work, this work will convert to the thermal energy. Agree? Yes. So we can solve the problems. We can see the initial energy equals to the final energy. So initial energy is the initial kinetic energy plus initial um, potential energy equals the final kinetic energy plus the final potential energy and also plus the thermal energy. The thermal energy comes from the work done by friction. And this friction force is a mu, mu k mg, right? This mu k is given, and m is given, so we can get the friction very easily. And also, what we don't know yet, the k. k is the constant of spring. And it tells us one question. You can see it tells a force of 25 Newton compress the spring, just 0 0.18 meter. So that means the force is 25 Newton. The Distance it moved 0.18 meter. So very easily we can get this k. Agree? K is good. So you can see we input the known quantities inside this, this equation. This is a core part for this solution. And this equation can be simplified as this one. And then you can see in this equation, x1 is given, k is given, mu k is given, mass is given. So we can very easily we can solve the function solve this function for x2, agree? After you input all the known quantities inside, you can solve the x2, 0 0.17 meter. Thank you.